Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and Ramadan Kareem for all of you who is watching this video and Ramadan and for those who are watching this video before Ramadan, I hope you are having a great time and you are prepared for Ramadan. Because Ramadan is just around the corner, I decided I'll show you guys what I got for my first week of Ramadan, I'll show you my groceries that I got yesterday, so let's get started. So the first thing I want to show you guys is this set of pants that I got. There are five different sizes in this. And you can see, I think, you see, they're, they're non-stick Swiss technology, that's what they say. But they're made of granite, yeah, granite surface and they are non-stick and I loved the color. I, I thought it was really cute, it's pink. So then there is one bigger pan, one smaller pan, one pot, small pot, one this pot and one another one. The top for this one is broken already, which I need to change. So yeah, I'm very happy with this purchase. Um, I got a really great deal on it. So in the food section, I got some vegetables, which are my daily have to have vegetables, which are like cucumber. I love my cucumber. Anyone who knows me, they know I love my cucumber. And uh, so I got two packs of them. Uh, the same goes for lettuce. So I love my cucumber and lettuce mix. And then I got broccoli for Zane. And I've also got him carrots. Fruit section, I just got it for a few days. So I think for Ramadan, I have to go and get some more fruits because they get rotten and spoil very quickly. So I just got one strawberry and blueberry for now. And then also, I got some bananas. I'm not a banana person, but they love them. So I got a pack of bananas for him. I also got some frozen food. So I got some corn mix and I want to make some spaghetti bolognese. I have to eat this one with my protein pasta. And then also I got some boiled chickpeas. And I got some organic chopped tomato. Some extra chopped tomato in the freezer never hurt. You never know when you're going to need tomatoes. Uh, coming to the dairy section, I got a few packs of milk for Zane. And also I got myself my albums unsweetened milk and then I also got the Coco Pops for Zane and I got the Zane's favorite yogurt so he would only eat this yogurt I mean any other yogurt he wouldn't eat it so this is Greek yogurt by the brand Kalios I guess uh, and two most important things about Ramadan dates and winter so i was looking for rohapsa uh, which is rose syrup basically you can add to the water and then it sweetens the water it's really sweet then i got wimto wimto is very similar to rohapsa it's a british version of the indian rohapsa for the same amount of syrup in wimto they have only 12 gram of carbs but in rohapsa they have 42 gram of carbs which is a big difference then I also got some beans, some natural ketchup thing. I'd love to show you guys this. This one is caramel syrup. Uh, okay, so caramel flavored sweetener, what's written on here? Basically, it's caramel syrup. I've been looking for it for a very long time. This one is sugar free and it's very hard to find it. It's almost impossible. I saw this in car for a few months back and then when I went back to check, I couldn't find it in any of the car for stores. But oh, I just hope Simba doesn't buy the pockets. But uh, when I went yesterday, they had it back in stock and I got one. Got stock of breads, which is probably enough for two weeks. And then also I've got myself the, it's called Lebanese Tenor. So the main reason I've got this one is that it, it, the whole wrap has even lesser calories than a whole milk bread slice. So I was quite impressed. And sorry guys, I forgot to mention one of the most important things for Ramadan is the dates. So I love this date much dough. It's very tasty, very moist. These are my favorite dates. So you can get them from many stores here in Dubai, but I got mine from Carrefour. It's um, about 90 dirham per kg, so it's the most expensive one. So it's the most expensive of the dates, but it's very 
uh, tasty but it's very moist very tasty and it's worth the price so guys this was all the shopping I've done for Ramadan yesterday but I'll still be adding some more meat uh, and seafood and stuff yeah. so so this was my video about Ramadan grocery shopping haul if you like the video please make sure you click the thumbs up button and subscribe to the channel as Ramadan is approaching quickly I'll be uploading many more Ramadan videos with Ramadan vlogs also subscribe to the channel and keep an eye out for my Ramadan decoration video on how to decorate your house for Ramadan and how I do it for our house thanks for watching once again I'll see you next video